Alright, what's going man? What's up? And welcome back to another video. This is going to be another reaction video today by Destiny called The Largest Animals to Ever Exist on Earth Size Comparison. Um, as you can see, I am, I'm back at the crib. I'm posting a reaction video today because I just got back today. But the gaming, the gaming going to be coming back now that I'm back at the crib and everything. So stay tuned for that. But let's get into this one. From the deep blue oceans to the lush forests, planet Earth has been home to some of the largest yes. and most impressive creatures in the history of life. Some of these animals are so massive that it's hard to even imagine their size. From towering herbivores to fierce predators, these huge creatures have left Man, I want to see a giant animal so bad. Like a, like a giant, video, giant animal. We'll take a look at some of the largest animals that ever lived on Earth and what the largest is today. From the biggest the whale, sauropod obviously. dinosaur to the gigantic creatures that prowled in the oceans, get ready to be amazed by the sheer size that these magnificent creatures possessed. Argentinosaurus is a massive herbivorous dinosaur that lived Shout during the late Cretaceous period, approximately 90 million years ago, in what is now Argentina. It's known for being one of the largest land animals that ever lived on the planet, with it's estimates like suggesting it may have reached lengths of up to 100 feet and weighed up to 100 tons. Its long neck Damn. weighed up around half its total body length, and it had a <clears> relatively <throat> small head, with a brain the size of a baseball. The bones Damn. of Argentinosaurus are some of the largest. Damn, imagine, imagine that. You that big and dumb as shit. That would be crazy, bro. The um the big and dumb like thing, I don't I don't feel like that. That makes sense. Cause it's just it's no way like it doesn't make sense to me that you can be hella big and your brain not be hella big. Because your other organs will obviously be big. But I'm no but I'm no, you know, doctor, so so don't don't come at me for that. But it's just crazy that this this big giant creature got the brain the size of a baseball, and he's as big as the Statue of Liberty. Just ever discovered? That's got to be a little cat. Measuring over six feet long, it was so big Damn. that it likely had to eat vast amounts of vegetation just to sustain itself, and it had uh. to eat up to half a ton of food each day. It probably faced very few predators due to its sheer size and strength. Like an elephant. But Argentinosaurus was not the only big dinosaur roaming the planet. Spinosaurus is a genus of theropod dinosaur that also lived during the late Cretaceous period, around 100 to 95 million years ago. It's mm. known for its distinctive sail-like structure on its back, which is formed by elongated spines of vertebrae. The first fossils of Spinosaurus were discovered in Egypt in the early 20th century, but they were destroyed during World War II. However, mm. new fossils have been discovered in recent years, providing more information about this unique and in like no mind, no mind, no dinosaur. Mind. It turns out that Spinosaurus didn't just hunt on land and is believed to have been a semi-aquatic dinosaur and spent a significant amount of time in and around water. Its adaptations for swimming included its long, narrow snout, which may have been used for catching fish, it's almost and its like webbed an feet were able to propel crocodile. the big, scary, sharp-toothed beast through water with ease. However, the jury is still out on just how fast a swimmer Spinosaurus was, and whether it spent all or just some of its time in water. Mm. Spinosaurus was one of the largest known carnivorous dinosaurs, with some estimates putting it at over 15 meters in length and weighed 8 metric tons. What that it's is probably about, safe about, to say that this dinosaur feet. was scary at any size and speed. But dinosaurs weren't the only huge animals to live on Earth. <clears throat> Shastasaurus is a prehistoric marine Shout reptile that lived during the late Triassic period around 210 to 215 million years ago. It's considered one of the largest known marine reptiles to exist on the planet, with some Shastasaurus mm. reaching lengths of up to 20 meters long. Like a manatee. Its size is comparable to that of a modern blue whale, making mm. it one of the largest creatures to have ever lived in the oceans. 
Shastasaurus was a highly adapted swimmer. Its elongated body and paddle-like limbs suggest that it was capable of sustained, efficient swimming. Its big, oddly shaped tail was likely used for propulsion, similar to that of a modern dolphin. Mm. Shastasaurus was a carnivore, so it's a big probably fed whale. on other marine reptiles and big large fish. Dolphin. Its elongated snout, filled with sharp teeth, suggests it was a specialized predator. But there were other specialized predators that would take its place millions of years later, lurking in the deep, always hunting and looking for its next meal. The infamous Megalodon, also known as the Megatooth Shark, is one of the most well-known prehistoric sharks that ever lived. This Definitely. huge shark lived during the Miocene epochs, approximately 23 to 3.6 million. Hey, y'all think the, the Megalodon is still alive in the um, Mariana Trench? Or not even like the Megalodon, that there's like some type of giant sea creature down there in the Mariana Trench? To me personally, I think I think that there's like pri... What is it? Is it primordial or... um? I don't know the word. I think it's primordial, but you know, like beings that have been there since the beginning of time. I think like those kind of things are at the bottom of the Mariana Trench or whatever, but I don't know. In years ago, and was one of the largest <coughs> predators to ever swim the oceans. The size of Megalodon is the most impressive feature of this species. The largest specimens of Megalodon found may have reached lengths of around 18 meters long and weighed up to 60 tons. To put this into perspective, the largest known great white shark, which is a close relative of Megalodon, only reaches a maximum length of around 6 meters and a weight of just 2.5 tons. I wish they did feet. One of in the reasons for the pounds. massive size of Megalodon so in America. is its diet. Scientists believe that these sharks fed on a variety of large marine mammals, including whales. The bite mm. force of Megalodon was estimated to be between 10 and 18 tons of pressure, which is more mm. than 10 times the bite force of the largest recorded great white shark. This allowed Megalodon to easily bite through the thick blubber of its prey. But despite its impressive size and strength, Megalodon went extinct around 3.6 million years ago. However, the exact cause of its extinction is still debated to this day. Some theories suggest that the extinction of the Megalodon was due to a decline in the availability of its prey or competition mm. with other predators. It's pretty pussy if you just got beat out by other predators. It's possible that one of the creatures that likely took over as the ocean's top predator might have been a giant known as Liviatan. This huge Leviathan. prehistoric whale lived approximately 12 to 13 million years ago during the Miocene Epoch. It was one of the largest predatory whales to have ever existed, with estimates mm. suggesting it could also grow up to 17 to 18 meters in length and weigh up to 50 that is, to 60 man. tons. We're just going to assume it's like 100 Livia feet or something. had large, robust jaws with teeth that could grow up to 36 centimeters in length, making them some of the largest <sighs> teeth of off. any known carnivorous animal. These teeth were blade-like and serrated, which would have been well suited for tearing into the flesh of prey. Based on the structure of its teeth, it's believed that Liviatan primarily preyed on large marine animals such as whales, seals, and other dolphins. Mm. Given their size and predatory nature, it's possible that Liviatan could have attacked and even killed and eaten a megalodon. However, it's important to note that there's no direct evidence of such an interaction as both species well, live millions of years apart and in different marine environments. When it comes to huge land animals, not many are aware of this next one. Paraceratherium would have been an intimidating animal I've to seen be that around, survival regardless evolved. if it was a herbivore or not. They were hornless, rhinoceros-like mammals that lived during the Oligocene Epoch, approximately 34 to 23 million years ago. It's definitely one Damn. of the largest land animals that's ever lived with an estimated weight of up to 18 metric tons, almost as much as three or four adult African elephants, and a height of over 5.5 meters at the shoulder. Paraceratherium had a long, flexible neck Probably and like a small feet. head in proportion to its massive body. It's believed to have been a herbivore, feeding on leaves and other vegetation. Believed. It had four large Shit, legs, each with three toes, shit. which were adapted for supporting its weight and allowing it to move across vast areas. 
But this wasn't the only giant land animal running around on the planet. There were three other giant animals roaming the land of North America around 23 to 20 million years ago. Deodon was one of the largest entelodonts, a group of pig-like mammals that roamed North America and Eurasia during the Oligocene and Miocene epochs. It stood over 2 meters tall at the shoulder and weighed up to 498 kilograms. Deodon was an omnivore that ate almost anything it could catch or scavenge, including small mammals, reptiles, birds, and carrion. It had a powerful bite force and sharp teeth that could crush bones. But the terror pig Deodon went extinct during the late Miocene, around 5 million years ago, possibly due to competition with other carnivores or climate change. Besides from the mammals, there were giant reptiles creeping around that you probably wouldn't want to meet, like this next monster. Megalania, Damn. also known as the giant ripper lizard, was a prehistoric predator Daniel. that lived in Australia during the Pleistocene epoch. It was a massive lizard that's estimated to have grown up to 6 meters long and weighed up to 680 kilograms, making it one of the largest lizards to have ever existed. One of the most interesting things about Mega. So you see how everything's big, all right? Big lizards, big everything. Like everything was just bigger. There's no so. So I think that we can all agree that like giants existed. Like there was there was definitely giant people at one point. If giant animals existed, that means giant people existed. I mean, uh, am I am I am I tripping or niggas gonna agree with me? Let me know. Galania is that it was able to climb trees. This <clears> is surprising <throat> given its large size and heavy body, but it's believed that Megalania used its strong claws to climb up trees to search for prey or escape from predators. Another interesting thing is that Megalania went extinct around 50,000 years ago. This means that it's very possible humans were either hunted or the hunters of Megalania. So far, we've covered a few of the biggest animals that are now extinct. But what are the largest animals on the planet today? Elephants, blue whales. If you answered whales, then you'd be correct. And you'd get yeah. a shiny gold star. When it comes to toothed whales, sperm whales are the largest and can grow up to 18 meters in length and weigh over 60 tons. About sperm six whales to are known feet, for their remarkable to ability to dive to incredible depths of up to 3,000 meters and stay underwater for over it's an about hour, 10, feet. making them one of the deepest diving mammals in the world. Sperm whales are apex predators and feed primarily on squid, but also eat fish and other marine animals. They're also known for their ability to use echolocation to locate prey in the deep ocean. Now, that seems huge, but there is one animal that's much, much bigger and its immense size and impressive abilities will simply blow your mind. Blue whale. Blue whales are the largest animals to have ever lived on Earth. Damn. They can grow up to 30.5 meters in length and weigh up to 200 tons, making them even much larger than any dinosaur that ever lived. Blue hmm. whales have a heart the size of a small car, Damn. weighing as much as 680 kilograms. A blue whale's heart only beats five to six times per minute, but pumps over 10,000 liters of blood with each beat. Okay, so Their obviously whales have been here actually made up of millions for a long of ass tiny time, right? So, diatoms. let me just pause that shit. So, do y'all think that back in the day, like we, I've, it's just like a water animal type of thing, so, and it probably like lived a long time ago, so they probably haven't found his bones, given the fact that niggas barely be exploring the ocean. But do y'all think like it was a it was a fat eye whale? Like if there was if this blue whale exists today and there was a time where animals were fucking five times the size that they are now, then it would make sense to me that there was like a whale or whales, you know, that were like because let's say this is a hundred feet, there had to be whales that are getting up there, like I don't know, maybe two hundred, three hundred, damn near, maybe even, you know, five hundred feet or something, you know. That's just like an estimate because if it's that big now and a, something like back in the day, like a lizard could have been like 10 feet back in the day and lizards be like this big now. You know what I'm saying? So, but I don't know. But and here's something, something else remarkable we bet you didn't know. Blue whales produce some of the loudest sounds in the animal kingdom. 
with their Figure. calls reaching up to 188 decibels. That's louder than a jet engine. Hmm. They also have a lifespan of about 80 to 90 years, putting them mm. right up there with humans as the longest living mammals on Earth. Sadly, mm. despite being the largest animal on the planet, blue whales are also one of the most endangered species, with only around 10,000 individuals remaining in the wild. Crazy. And that's a wrap on the largest animals video. Well, I hope that y'all enjoyed this one. If y'all did, leave a like, comment, subscribe, share, turn the post notification bells on. And peace, love, and positivity. And I will catch y'all in the next one, bro. It's two options in this world. Is you going to win or lose? Is you going to take the risk or not? You know you got to choose. Yeah, I can't keep one, so all my bitches come in twos.